Assalamu alaikum dear students how are you i hope you are fine by the grace of almighty allah i am also fine welcome to nieevs home school and this is mukhtar hussain assistant teacher national ideal english version school day shift today i am going to take an islamic studies class for the students of class 6 and our today's topic is chapter 1 lesson 6 discussion dear students now let's see the board topic chapter 1 lesson 6 discussion term of yearly 2020 22 lecture number 4 SW number also will be 4 and SW topic will be 5 K B Q from lesson 6 and today's date so dear students let's start our today's topic Chapter 6, uh, Chapter 1, Lesson 6. The topic of is Risalat. Dear students, I hope all of you know that Risalat, this term is well known to us. So let's start. Risalat is an Arabic word. It means message, news, letter, or conveyance of message or news. The duties and responsibilities that the messengers carry out are called Risala. Dear students, this is the definition of Risala. In the study of Aqaid, Risala comes next to Tawhid. It can be said that Nabuwat and Risala are almost synonymous. Identity of Prophet and Messenger Dear students, Prophet and Messengers, these terms are very well known to all of us, but Prophet and Messenger, Prophet and Messenger, it is, they are in English word, but its Arabic term are Prophet, Arabic term is Nabi, and Messengers, Arabic term is Rasul. So, the person who does the duties of Nubuat is a prophet or Nabi. On the other hand, the person who carries out the duties or responsibilities of Risalat is called a messenger or Rasul. Now we will learn difference between Nabi and Rasul. Nabi, those to whom no heavenly books were revealed are called Nabi or Prophet. Now Rasul, those to whom heavenly books were revealed are called Rasul or Messenger. My dear students, I repeat, Nabi, those to whom no heavenly books were revealed are called Nabi or Prophet. And Rasul, those to whom heavenly books were revealed are called Rasul or Messenger. Dear students, uh, this is an important information for us. Every Rasul was a Nabi, but every Nabi was not a Rasul. And for your kind information that Holy Prophet Hazrat Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam is uh, a Prophet and also a Rasul. He was both a Prophet and Rasul. Now, number of Nabi and Rasul. Their number is 124,000. This is an according to an opinion, but another opinion says that their number is 224,000. Among them, only 313 were Rasuls. But in the Holy Quran, 25. Uh, in the Holy Quran, there are 25 uh, prophets and prophets' names are mentioned. We all, all of us have already learned in the Holy Quran. So now, SW, yes, the students, your SW topic will be also KBQ, that means knowledge based question, any five. You will make it from lesson six. And I repeat, uh, someone have uh, written uh, 
KBQ as like a broad question. No, it will be a short question like an MCQ or short question. And your answer should be uh, in one sentence or two sentence. So that's all for today. Yes, students, I hope you have understood today's topic. Uh, keep practicing at your home. Abide by your parents. Stay safe and well. See you again, inshallah. Till then, assalamu alaikum.